All right, to start off connecting to this room, you go to the same place that you normally go for airplay. You're gonna mirror, and this is room 247. And immediately you'll see the code. The code pops up. If these TVs are off, they tend to turn on. So you put in your code. This one's today, is 7955. Uh, well, I guess I got that wrong. Uh, it's hard to do this with one hand. Uh, now it's 5368. And you'll see it go up. And you have the same options you have at any other AirPlay. You can use that as a mirror or as an extension, separate display. Uh, but the thing is, is that only works with these two. So this is the part that I've tried to communicate in words, but a video is probably better. Um, you'll see this TV right here is kind of humming along, but it's in the wrong source. Uh, so you just go to this panel right here and you're gonna switch sources to Apple TV. And then that one is also linked with the same thing. This TV, for whatever reason, doesn't really turn on by itself. So if you wanna get all four TVs, you just reach underneath here and there's a power button, tap, and in that way you've connected all four screens in the room so that you can show the class what you need to show them and all the speakers are working too so if there's any audio it'll play in all the all speakers in the room. If you need to talk, um, speaking to speakers, there are, there is, there was a microphone, I can't find it right now but normally it's right here. And you can turn that on and then just face it up to those black uh, uh, receivers. And then that lets you amplify your room, especially when it's kind of a noisy room. Hope this helps.